Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Dr. Zina speaking. Today we'll be talking about what is the difference between cyclic fatigue and torsional stress in the field of endodontics. But before we continue, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below for more and more videos. Now, what is cyclic fatigue? As the name suggests, cyclic, as if a bicycle. So bicycle equal to cyclic. So occurs when the instrument does not bind in the canal, but rotates freely in a curvature whilst being subjected to repeated cycles of tension and compression similar to the bicycle. The bicycle keeps rotating, rotating, it does not bind to the rod, okay? So this is how you can remember it. Whenever you hear the word cyclic fatigue, cyclic equal to bicycle, the bicycle keeps rotating, okay? You move the bicycle, so the, uh, the tires of the bicycle, they keep rotating, they will never stop, they will never bind onto the road. So this is what is cyclic fatigue. Uh, usage of the fire agent. Now, what about the torsional stress? Tor torsional stress occurs when the tip of the instrument it binds in the canal, okay, but the motor continues to rotate. So this is how you can differentiate between them. Cyclic fatigue equal to bicycle. The bicycle bicycle keeps rotating; it does not bind. In comparison with the torsional stress, it like it's like a glue, so it will bind in the canal. Okay, the tip of the instrument will bind in the canal, but the motor will continue to rotate, continue to rotate. So, which means that when you remove the fire, you will see that the tip of the fire is broken at the apical end of the root. This is due to what? Due to the torsional stress. So here you can see in the video that the tip of the fire binds into the canal, but the motor continues to rotate, continues to rotate. So when you try to remove the fire at the end, you will see that the tip of the fire is broken, very broken at the apical end of the what I said so we have two types of fatigue that can be seen in endodontics we have cyclic fatigue and torsional fatigue or you can say cyclic fatigue and torsional stress any of these are correct terms that can be used now number one is the cyclic fatigue cyclic fatigue similar to the bicycle the bicycle the the wheels of the bicycle they keep on rotating they won't stop so they want why they won't stop because they do not bind to the rod they do not bind to the rod so that's why they keep rotating similar to the cyclic fatigue cyclic fatigue the file it does not bind into the canal okay it keeps on rotating and due to the excessive use of the file while rotating it okay it may break at the end so this is due to the cyclic fatigue what about the torsional stress now torsional stress occurs when the file binds into the canal the tip of the file not all the file only the tip of the file binds into the canal and the motor will keep rotating will keep rotating okay so when you remove the file you will see that the tip of the file is broken this is due to what the torsional stress. So always when you see the tip of the file is broken at the apical end of the canal or the root, this is due to the torsional stress at the end. Okay. Uh, so what we need to do in order to avoid cyclic fatigue and torsional stress is that do not apply too much pressure with the fires when you insert the fires. Never apply too much pressure and always basically need to uh, go with the glide path. A glide path should be achieved first. Do not go immediately to the full working length without achieving the glide path because the files will break at the end due to the either cyclic fatigue or torsional stress. In addition to that, never sterilize the files because, because if you sterilize the files, they will be dull 
and they can easily break okay and another thing never reuse the fires only use the fires for one time only the fires are not meant to be reusable they're only you meant to be for single use only because if you reuse it again their efficiency will be lower than the first time okay so which means that they can break they have more chances to be broken inside the canals than the new fires so these are all my tips and tricks that i spoke about that's it i am done thank you all for watching my video if you have any questions please do write it down in the comment section below and goodbye